I think singing has an extraordinary restorative power and it's something people aren't necessarily aware of when they're involved in it. You just come away feeling better for it. And I think for us at Dartmouth Prison, it is exactly that. It's, it's a collective endeavour. It's people coming together to be part of something, singing together and feeling good about themselves for a bit. We face a real crisis in the prison system and for us it's an opportunity to go in and work with some of these guys and give just a level of hope and a light at the end of the tunnel and an opportunity to be involved in a group activity that takes them outside their daily routine of prison life. And they get swept along with this and they suddenly realize you know they adopt a can-do attitude and some of these guys they've never even set foot on a stage before let alone open their mouth to sing one thing that's very important to us is that we try and take as many people into jails as possible get the general public in uh, to have a better understanding of what, you know, what they are really like. And I, I think it, it means an awful lot to these guys. I've even had people you know, take me aside during rehearsals and say, I mean, quite literally, Adam, you stopped me from killing myself by allowing us to, you know, me to have this opportunity to come and do something. It's a real crisis. If there's anything we can do to get into these places and make the lives of these um, inmates better and prepare them for a life beyond the gate, that's our mission, if you like. Oh, my God.